Hey guys, uh, this is probably going to be part one of installing this Tirity Pro exhaust on my third gen 2016 Tacoma. I ended up picking this up for about 400 bucks. I bought a Flowmaster at one point. It was way too loud when, uh, when I was towing or basically going up any steep hill. So not going to fly because I live on basically a hill right now. So I ended up buying this 2D Pro exhaust for about 400 bucks. Pretty decent deal. And uh, the plan is to basically sand this all down. I'm going to paint this with a gloss black or a semi-gloss black. Uh, high temperature heat paint and then I'm thinking about also the TRD letters here uh, painting them red if I can figure out how to uh, put down some tape basically my plan is is to paint the letters red and then to put down some tape that basically covers them and then paint the rest black and take off the tape and hopefully that works we'll see how it goes but uh, also don't mind the basement looks a little dirty we got the old lathe over there but uh, yeah right now just gonna sand this all down try and get it down to pretty clean bare metal Shouldn't really take too much because it's all mainly surface rust. And then uh, we'll paint her black and we're good to go. Hi guys, welcome back to the garage. I am uh, gonna basically basically turn my car off the rafter. There you go, not bad. And I'm gonna paint the TRD afterwards. So that's why I haven't bothered with it. Alright. Alright guys, so about 2 a.m. I don't know why I decided to do it at 2 a.m. but this is why I decided to do it. I'm going to try it this way with my heat gun because this is heat activated paint. Uh, obviously I won't be able to really bake it on like once it's on my vehicle but I think this should at least help with the curing process. <laughs> Alright guys, so this is my very OSHA approved way of doing this. Basically what I did is I took the empty paint can and I stuffed it into the exhaust so that basically it kind of prevents some of the airflow. Right now it's 32 degrees outside. I know, right? Not really the best time to do this. But if I feel this, my muffler is actually starting to heat up. Surprisingly. And like this tailpipe starting to heat up. So uh, I think if I just leave this running for like an hour, it'll, it'll actually cook the exhaust. And man, look at that thing. It's pretty sweet. PRD. But even this is starting to get warm to the touch now. Well. I figured this thing would be too big of a heat sink for that little heat gun, but seems like she's just pumping on enough heat to, to do it. 
So I'm gonna stay down here and supervise just to just to make sure I don't burn the place to the ground. Granted, it's really not in the best shape anyway, so <laughs> if it did burn to the ground, I don't think anybody would complain. Alright guys, so quick little update. It's been running for about 30 minutes. And now it's even starting to heat up the tailpipe all the way over here. So if you're uh, in really cold weather like I am, and it's 32 degrees, and you don't want to paint this on your vehicle like I did, uh, basically just do what I did. Put this on, and uh, maybe in an hour it'll finally be cured. All right, guys, welcome back. Uh, as you can see, the exhaust is now, uh, for the most part, done. Um, it's got my. Oops. Got my can of caliper paint. It's going to shake it up pretty good. There we go. Now, yeah, obviously the TRD letters. A little bit stealth when they're just all black, but uh, I think the red is going to look sweet once I'm done. So, <sighs> pop my gloves on, feel the exhaust. Oh, yeah, she's cold to the touch now, so that means I won't have to worry about anything melting on here. Take out my. Actually, yeah, I don't. All right, so at some point I'm going to finish this. I'm going to resand this, and then I'm actually going to get the letters to be red. Uh, I basically taped this off. I did this very nice job, and then uh, right at the end, the wind picked up and blew a piece of tape right over this, so it screwed up all the paint now. But uh, the rest of this thing looks sweet. All right, guys. So today... I plan on finally undoing my mistakes where I have that tack welded right now uh, for my stock exhaust. And I plan on basically cutting these bolts off and replacing the nuts with some brand new hardware and uh, basically replacing my exhaust. So yeah, let's uh, jump right into it. It'll be the TRD Pro exhaust. Man, my truck is filthy under here. But it is the end of winter, so. I guess I expect that. Look at that motherfucker. Well, there wasn't anything. I'll show you the new bolts. It's crazy the difference. Let's just pound this other fucker out. There we go. Yeah, that wasn't that was a lot of work. Totally not. <laughs> Fucking Christ. I'm 
So, that's what she looks like right now. I am definitely gonna fix the lettering, but it's okay. Just my exhaust. We'll start it up. Ooh. 